We're going to walk through this uh, IXL C4 on finding complementary, supplementary, vertical, and adjacent angles is going to be a new one. Adjacent means angles that are right next to. So let's go through. We're going to go kind of quickly through this lesson. It's not very hard. The measure of an angle is 50 degrees. It's complement. Uh, complementary means it's going to add up to 90 degrees. And so uh, 50 plus 40 is 90. So the complement will be 40. And we'll move on our way. If a measure is uh, of an angle is 64 degrees, uh, what's the measure of its supplementary angle? We got to go 180 minus uh, 64, which is 116 degrees. And the measure of an angle is 161, so its supplement will make it go up to 180. So it's going to be 19 degrees. And look at this, we're already cruising. We're at a 28. The measure of an angle is 53. Its complement means it adds up to 90. That's going to be uh, 37 degrees. And look at that. We're at a 36. The measure of an angle is 88. Its supplement is going to be 92. Just going to go 180 minus 88. And I'm just going to take that, or did I have to click it again? There we go, keep it up. Now, uh, we can see they're asking for the value of T, and um, we don't know the total. Uh, it's not a 90, it's not a 180, but it's only 73. And to find T, we're gonna just go 73, and we're gonna take away uh, 45, 45, I'm sorry. So that's gonna be 28 degrees uh, is T, uh, 73 take away 45. The measure of an angle is 4. Uh, its complement is going to make it uh, up to 90, so that's going to be 86 degrees. And this one, what's the value of R? Well, you can see R is directly across. That makes it a vertical angle. And so R is also 48.4 degrees. And we don't forget the decimal. And look at that. we got a score. We're at 55. And if it's W, well, you can get a calculator out if you want. You can see that this whole thing right here makes a straight line. 180 minus 80.6 is 99.4 degrees. I hope I did the math right. Look at that. We're at 64. Uh, here is a straight line. 30.3. This is an adjacent angle. It's right next to, and it makes a straight line. So angle P is adjacent to 30.3. It makes a 180, and that means it's going to be 149 0.7. If you get a calculator out, you want to do that subtraction, you can, but those two are supplements. And where are we at? We're at a 68. Value of M, well, that's at a vertical angle. It's going to be vertical to the 52.9, so it's equal to 52.9. I don't think that the problems are really going to get a, a whole lot harder. It's going to take my answer there. Clicking submit, there we go. And here's another vertical angle. Well, it's going to be 42.7 degrees. So you can see that this one isn't going to be the hardest thing you ever did. Uh, there's a supplement to 105.6. You do got to subtract 105.6 from 180, and you're going to get 74.4. If you remember your places, you use your calculator if you want. That's fine. All right, so this lesson's not really that difficult. You can see that in a grand total of, I don't know, five minutes if it'll let me heck i spend more time waiting for my internet connection to hit click submit so i'm going to go ahead and there i am i'm at 78 and i i guess i could do this one uh complementary angle means it adds up to 90 to add up to 66 is going to be 23.7 i think and that's going to be it all right so good luck go get your work done and enjoy your weekend